Are you eating or drinking while surfing YouTube? If so, you may want to stop, at least temporarily, while you watch this video. Or not. I mean, people all over the world are ingesting food and drinks created from human or animal waste. Some might consider this the ultimate in being eco-friendly, reusing what otherwise certainly wouldn't have a lot of other purposes. In some ways, this is an ingenious puzzle because there are many hungry people and food and beverages are pretty expensive. If there are ways to feed people healthy and nutritious meals from these leftovers, then surely it could be helpful. I mean, let's face it, people are simply fascinated with what their bodies do anyway, so we're not surprised you're here watching this video. One of the best-selling picture books for generations has been Everybody Poops. So get ready to expand your palate and learn about 10 foods and drinks that are made from poop and from pee. Number 10. Your favorite burger probably has poop. We know, we know, we know. When you start to learn what's actually in your favorite foods, it can make you a bit queasy. Candy bars actually do have a small percentage of insect legs in them, for example, but Eric Schlosser explained in the book Fast Food Nation, The Dark Side of the All-American Meal, that there is poop in hamburger. Consumer Reports has tested 300 packages of ground beef purchased from over 100 different stores in more than 25 cities across the USA, and they found that 100% of the meat they looked at had fecal contamination. Personally, this is making us want to switch to hot dogs at the next barbecue, but we're wondering what Consumer Reports would find when they looked into that. Honestly, we're probably just better off not knowing. Number 9. You'll actually eat baby poo sausages. What's more alarming about these baby poop sausages, other than the fact that they actually exist, is the news that they're kind of delicious. The sausages were created in Spain by researchers who used three types of bacteria from the baby's poop. Part of us wonders what they were talking about in the first place to inspire looking at baby feces as a great source for the next yummy sausage to offer. But that's just us, apparently. Number 8. NASA is really into making you eat poop. In 2016, NASA received a grant to work on repurposing astronaut feces into food. Now, do remember that NASA is not just looking at sending astronauts to the moon now, but also on longer missions, such as to Mars. This means that efficient food solutions are critical. Basically, at some point in the future, NASA is probably going to come up with some sort of device that turns your poo into food. Good times. Number 7. USA astronauts drink pee, but Russians won't. On the International Space Station, the USA astronauts drink pee in something called condensate, which is actually their breath and sweat. While Russian astronauts won't touch it, the USA astronauts drink this, and it's collected from the entire crew on the ISS, including the 12 mice that live on board. Lane Kartner, the water subsystem manager at the International Space Station, states, It tastes like bottled water. But Carter does admit that you do have to get past the thought that it is pee and condensate that you're actually drinking. Number 6. We know you've eaten mouse poop, and so does the FDA. Do keep in mind that food standards in the USA are generally excellent, but it might surprise you to know that the FDA actually has a document called a Defect Levels Handbook. This explains how much of what type of defects, like mouse poop, insect parts, mold, etc., is permitted on what type of food. The FDA explains that it's economically impractical to grow, process, and harvest raw food products that could be 100% free of defects. Also, the defects in the amounts listed in the handbook pose no true risk to your health. So, if you dare take a look at the handbook to see what's permitted in some of your favorite foods, just don't blame us if you suddenly start to lose a lot of weight. Number 5. In Korea, you can get drunk on feces wine called Tongsol. Dongsol is a traditional Korean drink made by Dr. Lee Chang Su. This is an alcoholic wine made from feces. It's made from poop from a child that has been fermented, and Korean rice wine is also used. Tongsol is actually also considered to be a form of medicine, not simply an alcoholic drink. We're not entirely sure how someone came to the conclusion that poop would make a great source for wine, and we don't really want to know. Imagine looking at a child's poop and thinking, I'd really like to drink that. Honestly, probably the less said about this, the better. Come to think of it. Number 4. One of the world's most expensive coffees is made from animal poop. Coffee lovers and people who seek out indulgences of many types actually are very fond of Kopi Luwak, also known as civet coffee. This coffee has been made from coffee cherries that the civet cats have eaten and digested and then has come out in their feces. As the coffee beans go through the civet cat, they are actually fermented. This Kopi Luwak coffee is considered to be one of, if not the most expensive coffee in the world, at $700 per kilogram. Kopi Luwak is most often created on the islands of Bali, Sumatra, and Java. 
and the coffee cherries are also found in the Philippines. So, you might wonder, what does coffee taste like after it's been through a civet cat's digestive tract? Well, critics agree to disagree. Some love it, others just love to trash this pricey coffee. One belief is that fans like it because it's super rare and very expensive, so to have it shows that you're one of the few elite people who can afford it. Number 3. Elephants never forget to have coffee, and they make it too. Well, those civet cats had better watch their bags, because coming up close behind in the coffee poop business are some ambitious northern Thailand elephants creating black ivory coffee. This, too, is considered to be one of the world's most priciest coffees. So what exactly does coffee taste like after it's been through the stomach and intestines of a herd of 20 elephants? Well, it's rumored to have an earthy flavor, which seems rather obvious, but it's also said to be rather nice and smooth. Number two, thinking about drinking pee? Well, just make it a cocktail. An enterprising UK site that sells bathroom fixtures published a unique cocktail recipe book with drinks you might want to try. What's going to surprise you is they're all alcohol free, but they do have one other important ingredient. If you're interested, check out the complete urine drinkers cocktail guide to learn what tasty cocktails you might want to consider the next time you've got to pee. Number one, pee becomes beer, which becomes pee, which becomes beer. You get the idea. Now, we've left the very best for last. Scientists in Belgium have created a solar energy machine that takes pee and actually turns it into beer, something we think is probably making a lot of people smile right now. We know you're going to turn that beer back into pee, which you could then turn into beer again. The solar energy turns the pee into water, which is then brewed as beer. We think the scientists at Ghent University should be particularly pleased with themselves because people who don't normally pay attention to scientific developments are probably paying close attention to this one. But in all seriousness, this technology could actually be pretty useful in developing countries. There's only one question that's left, and that's what came first, the pee or the beer? So I really hope you found that video interesting. If you did, please do give us a thumbs up below. Don't forget to subscribe. Brand new videos just like this every day of the week. And as always, thank you for watching.